Hey guys, it's Leanne here from Wild Gold Helper. I decided to uh, do a Minecraft video. I haven't really decided what all my plans are going to be yet. I may make a Minecraft blog, but I'm not sure. Oh, something completely random just happened. A cow just... one of my cows died. That is weird. Look out my window, see some leather. Well, it actually sucks. Um, hmm. I guess this kind of is putting my video on hold for a minute. I wasn't expecting that. I'm going to have to go see how many cows are alive. This also makes me wonder how my cow died. That's very odd. Like, this is just single player. Well, on a good note, there is at least two, al two alive, so I can... Uh, make them uh, mate. As well, if you don't know how to make cows, you just need wheat. Um, oh, there's some meat. You just mm. click them like this. There's a heart. Click the other one and watch them get busy and then a little baby will pop out. Which are quite cute. Mm. As you can see, their heads are huge. Mm. But, um, yeah, so that was totally unexpected. I have no idea how that cow died. Mm. Anyways, this video, primarily that, this wasn't part of the video, sorry, that just kind of randomly came up. It's about this over here. Um, I'm on a Hexit mod pack, so I, I don't know what's in all the mod packs, right? We have some battle towers, and then, I like calling this maybe a, I don't know, dungeon, I suppose, but I did cheat. I started at the top floor by putting the ladder up and getting to the top, which, it was daylight when I started, so I had no monsters up top. I was able to take the items from the chest and keep going. Now, I'm not going to just uh, bother running down here, but I'll show you what I did. Every floor... Oh, I fell anyways. Okay, anyways. Every floor, you can, you should be able to see all the chests and such. I opened... After I killed everything, I would open up and let sun down to the next floor to help prevent things from spawning. Um, so, during this, during the day, is very important to make sure that happens. Um, another thing I did, I'd use my pickaxe and I would pick the monster spawners and actually just get rid of them entirely because that helped too. Now, the bottom floor, when I got down there, I was able to open the chest but it would close up again and I could hear a guardian in the distance but couldn't see it. So, I would take a little bit of damage, I would run away, go back down. I actually had the cheat, I ended up just doing... Well, this, basically, I would pick the uh, chest, and the chest would drop, and all the items would drop, and then I would have to do it to the next side, and then I just kind of, well, booted it after that, basically. Um, but yeah, so, before I show you the items I got from that, this is my house. I uh, spawned nearby a village, so I decided I was going to put my house in the village, well, for two reasons. One, um, some of the... Uh, houses, primarily the blacksmith shop has a chest usually where I could steal an item to start out with. Um, also, the garden benefit really helps. If you don't want to make a garden, you can just eat their food and replant it. Or what I did, I took some of their food for seeds and uh, made my own garden. As you can see, I got wheat, uh, potatoes, carrots, cotton plants, sugar cane, and then some uh, pumpkins on the go. Um, but yeah, this is a common design I use for my houses. I make, uh, usually just a simple cobblestone house or stone house. Um, a garden. And I always have a barn. I will be getting chickens at some point. There's some way yonder over there, but I've had issues getting them back to follow me, so I haven't really, um, kept up with getting them, basically. Uh, this is my house, so the, uh, little dungeon over there, I was able to get an anvil from it. Um, so I'm, you know, I'll be honest, I, in my mm. server I plan, somebody mentioned they're good to have, though I don't even know what they're for, I'm gonna have to look them up, I'm guessing you maybe repair stuff with mm. it. These are some of the items that I got, uh, while taking out that building. I got quite a bit of weapons, as you can see. Um, a shield, uh, these, so I'll probably throw those away, that was just from when I was digging the floors, we got some emeralds, quite a few staffs, uh, magic essence, some bread, uh, poison grenade, ender pearl, uh, golden pear, uh, golden carrot, not pear, 
Um, and then the Void Satchel, which I'm not sure if I can... I, maybe I need to be somewhere else to use that, because I, I tried to put it down on my bar, and it didn't open like a backpack, but maybe there's a different way to use it. Um, and over here we got another staff, leather boots, and... Uh, oh, it's in my inventory. Phoenix Feather. That was the other item I got was a Phoenix Feather. Um, the Phoenix Feather is seems pretty good actually what I read online about it I, I think when you die it saves your items um, so when you come back you actually didn't lose anything so that's a pretty good benefit it's the same as a keeping charm actually the server I play on we have some uh, NPCs on it that sell items um, basically there's a vendor and you trade stuff to the vend well you trade stuff for a coin actually so you can trade like stacks of cobblestone stacks of dirt or more expensive items like a diamond to get more coin and from there you can get uh, some of the items we have would be higher end weapons armor um, the keeping charm along with a magic mirror which is also nice to have but um, oh that cow's so cute I'll show you down here uh, yeah so started digging out down here to get more cobblestone and such and then I got some bookshelves on the go I plan on placing my enchanting table here that will be when I actually find some mm. obsidian I haven't uh, came across any yet um, but yeah so the, the main point of this video I just kinda want to show the uh, building that I got the items from and this is that was the first successful one I took down again like I said I kind of feel like I cheat it by breaking uh, down to put sunlight in each room and then at the end of it just breaking the chest open to stop taking damage because I couldn't find the guardian um, on our server we do uh, occasionally me and a couple friends or just one person might go and uh, do a battle tower and then we'll split the items which seems fair I mean if you're getting lots of iron and such uh, you know, for the help at least, it's nice to divide it up, make it equal. Um, but yeah, so I haven't made WoW videos in a while, like I mentioned earlier, so I'll probably make uh, more videos, hopefully, well, probably not WoW, but maybe more Minecraft videos. Um, and I'm just going to post them on my WoW channel, since I already have people on there that watch my videos, and I may introduce a blog too, I'm not sure yet, but... Um, you know, thanks for sh stopping by. Uh, have a nice day, and hope you enjoyed the video.